The face of education is changing, and in Minnesota, change can be seen in public schools across the state. Minnesota is, a, is a, a state with changing demographics. We don't look at the same that we did 10, 15 years ago, and that's a good thing. We need to make sure that education is responding to that change. The Minnesota School Boards Association is responding to that change, and they're looking towards the future. The school board members today are not the school board members from 20 or 30 years ago, so we need to make sure we're listening to all of our members. The MSBA embarked on a path to meet their challenges and reworked their strategic focus. So within the strategic plan, we really focused on three big areas, talking about um, equity and diversity, also wanted to rebrand, and thirdly, we were trying to seek what our members' needs were. A plan to survey membership was adopted, and then I think the one that was most needed was our plan to look forward with diversity, equity, and inclusion. About 30% of our students in Minnesota, the 846,000 students in Minnesota, 30% are students of color. We felt we need to really be at the forefront and take a leadership role in this area. Now with the new brand and the new logo and the new tagline, we felt that we have a perfect opportunity to really bring some consistency to the use of our logo and to the use of our brand and having MSBA be a real recognizable, a recognizable force. And school board members from across the state like what they see from the MSBA. The fact that the Summer Institute is going to talk about issues related to equity and that's the focus of it is uh, very powerful and very timely. MSBA I see is the, the organization that instead of being reactive to things as they happen, I really see them as being proactive, 